the James Webb Space Telescope, JWST, frequently hailed as the replacement for the Hubble Space Telescope, has revolutionized how we interpret the universe. Since its launch, the telescope has provided a remarkable perspective on the universe, revealing secrets and uncovering sights previously unheard of by mankind. The JWST's cutting-edge technology has allowed researchers to explore the farthest reaches of space, investigating galaxies, stars, and planetary systems formed billions of years ago. This exposition dives into the numerous aspects of the JWST, from its mechanical wonders to its notable discoveries, and discusses how it has reshaped our understanding of the universe. To appreciate the significance of the JWST, understanding its predecessor, the Hubble Space Telescope, is fundamental. Launched in 1990, Hubble provided astronomers with the first clear images of distant galaxies, nebulae, and stars, free from the obscuring effects of Earth's atmosphere. Hubble's contributions to science are immense, from determining the pace of the universe's expansion to observing the impact of comet Shoemaker-Levy 9 with Jupiter. Its deep field images, capturing light from galaxies billions of light years away, have given us a brief glimpse into the early universe. However, in spite of its triumphs, Hubble had limitations. Its primary mirror's 2.4-meter diameter restricted its light-gathering capability, and its instruments were designed for ultraviolet, visible, and near-infrared parts of the spectrum. As space experts pushed the limits of our knowledge, it became clear that another telescope was needed, one capable of observing in the infrared range, where it could peer through astronomical dust clouds and observe the universe's first galaxies. The idea for the James Webb Space Telescope began to take shape in the mid-1990s, even before Hubble had reached its full potential. Named after James E. Webb, NASA's administrator during the Apollo era, the JWST was envisioned as the next great observatory, a telescope that would look further back in time than Hubble, capturing the light from the first stars and galaxies formed after the Big Bang. The JWST's design presented significant engineering challenges. Unlike Hubble, which orbits Earth at an altitude of around 570 kilometers, the JWST would be positioned at the second Lagrange point, L2, about 1.5 million kilometers from Earth. This location offers a stable environment with minimal interference from Earth's heat and light, but it also means that the telescope cannot be adjusted or repaired by astronauts. To observe the faint, distant objects it was designed to study, the JWST required a much larger mirror than Hubble. The solution was a segmented mirror made of 18 hexagonal beryllium segments coated with gold, giving the telescope a total diameter of 6.5 meters. This mirror had to be folded to fit inside the Ariane 5 rocket that would launch it and would only unfold once the telescope reached its destination. The JWST also required a sunshield to block heat and light from the sun, earth, and moon, keeping the telescope's instruments at their operating temperature of just a few degrees above absolute zero. The sunshield, the size of a tennis court, is made of five layers of a special material called captain, which can withstand extreme temperatures. After years of planning, delays, and budget overruns, the JWST was finally launched on December 25, 2021. The launch was a groundbreaking event, watched by scientists and space enthusiasts worldwide. The Ariane 5 rocket carried the telescope into space, and over the next 30 days, the JWST embarked on a complex and carefully planned series of deployments. The sun shield was the first major part to unfold, a process that involved many instruments and thousands of parts working in concert. Any failure could have doomed the mission. After the sun shield was successfully deployed, the mirror segments began to unfold and align themselves. This process took several months, as each segment had to be positioned with nanometer accuracy. By mid-2022, the JWST had completed its deployment and calibration, and its instruments were ready to begin collecting data. The first images released to the public were truly breathtaking. The telescope's ability to observe in the infrared revealed the universe in a new light, with astonishing clarity and detail. One of the primary goals of the JWST is to observe the first galaxies that formed after the Big Bang billions of years ago. These galaxies are so distant that their light has been stretched into the infrared range due to the expansion of the universe, 
a phenomenon known as redshift. Hubble could observe these ancient objects, but the JWST's infrared capabilities allow it to see them in extraordinary detail. In its first year of operation, the JWST made several major discoveries. One of the most significant was the detection of galaxies that existed just a few hundred million years after the Big Bang. These galaxies appeared larger and more developed than previously thought, challenging existing theories of galaxy formation and evolution. Researchers had long believed that the first galaxies were small and slowly grew over time by merging with other galaxies. However, the JWST observations suggest that some galaxies formed much more quickly and became massive earlier than expected. This discovery has prompted astronomers to reconsider their models of how galaxies form and evolve. The JWST also captured images of cosmic structures that had never been seen before. For example, the telescope observed the intricate details of the cosmic web, a vast network of filaments that connects galaxies across the universe. These filaments are made of dark matter and gas and are the scaffolding upon which galaxies form and evolve. The JWST observations of the cosmic web have provided new insights into the large-scale structure of the universe and the role of dark matter in shaping it. The JWST has also transformed our understanding of star formation and stellar evolution. Stars form in dense clouds of gas and dust, which block visible light. However, infrared light can penetrate these clouds, allowing the JWST to observe the process of star formation in unprecedented detail. One of the telescope's most memorable targets was the Orion Nebula, a stellar nursery located about 1,344 light-years from Earth. The JWST images revealed many young stars, some of which were still embedded in their natal clouds. These observations have provided new insights into how stars form and evolve, as well as the processes that lead to the formation of planetary systems. The JWST has also observed the final stages of stellar evolution, capturing stunning images of dying stars and the nebulae they create. These observations have provided insight into the processes that govern the end of a star's life, including the formation of white dwarfs, neutron stars, and black holes. Perhaps one of the most exciting aspects of the JWST mission is its ability to study exoplanets, planets that orbit stars outside our solar system. The telescope's instruments are capable of analyzing the atmospheres of these distant worlds, searching for signs of habitability and possibly life. In its first year of operation, the JWST made several key discoveries related to exoplanets. One of the most notable was the discovery of LHS 475b, an exoplanet located about 41 light-years from Earth. This planet is roughly the same size as Earth and orbits its star in just two days. The JWST observations revealed that LHS 475b has a thick atmosphere, possibly composed of water vapor, carbon dioxide, or methane. The JWST has also observed other exoplanets with different atmospheres. Some of these planets have thick, hazy atmospheres rich in methane and other hydrocarbons, while others have clear atmospheres dominated by hydrogen and helium. These observations have provided valuable data on the diversity of planetary systems and the conditions that might support life. One of the most intriguing questions in cosmology is whether life exists elsewhere in the universe. While the JWST cannot directly detect life, it can look for biosignatures, chemical markers that may indicate the presence of life. For example, the detection of oxygen or methane in an exoplanet's atmosphere could suggest the presence of biological processes. The JWST's ability to study exoplanets has opened a new era in the search for life beyond Earth. In addition to its investigations of distant galaxies and exoplanets, the JWST has captured images of some of the most beautiful and mysterious objects in the universe. One of the most striking is the Tarantula Nebula, a massive star-forming region located in the Large Magellanic Cloud, a satellite galaxy of the Milky Way. The Tarantula Nebula, also known as 30 Doradus, is a vast region of gas and dust where thousands of new stars are being born. The JWST images of this region reveal intricate filaments of gas, glowing clusters of young stars, and the remnants of supernova explosions. 
These observations have provided new insights into the processes that drive star formation and the life cycles of massive stars. The JWST has also captured stunning images of nebulae such as the Ken Cloud and the Bird Cloud, revealing details that were previously hidden from view. These images have not only captured the public's imagination, but have also provided valuable data for astronomers studying the birth and death of stars. While the JWST has made tremendous strides in our understanding of the universe, its journey has not been without challenges and controversies. The telescope's development was plagued by delays and cost overruns, with a final price tag reaching nearly $10 billion, substantially higher than the original estimate. These issues sparked debates within the scientific community and among policymakers about the project's feasibility and value. Some critics argued that the funds allocated to the JWST could have been better spent on other scientific endeavors, while others contended that the telescope's potential for groundbreaking discoveries justified the cost. The James Webb Space Telescope's mission is not only a testament to the advances of modern science and engineering, but also a reflection of humanity's innate desire to explore the unknown. Through the JWST, we are peering into the deepest corners of the cosmos, uncovering the universe's earliest secrets and advancing our search for life beyond our planet. As the telescope continues to send back data, it promises to reshape our understanding of the universe in profound ways. In the decades to come, the JWST will undoubtedly inspire new generations of scientists, engineers, and dreamers to look up at the stars and wonder what lies beyond. As we look ahead, the future of the James Webb Space Telescope holds immense promise. The data that the JWST continues to send back will fuel research for decades to come, enabling scientists to further investigate the mysteries of the early universe, the formation of galaxies, stars, and planetary systems, and the potential for life elsewhere in the cosmos. The telescope's ability to observe the faintest, most distant objects in the universe with unparalleled clarity opens new possibilities for understanding the fundamental forces that have shaped our universe from the very beginning. One of the long-term goals of the JWST is to shed light on the nature of dark matter and dark energy, two of the most enigmatic components of the universe. While they make up the majority of the universe's mass and energy, dark matter and dark energy remain largely unexplained. The JWST's observations of galaxy formation and evolution, as well as its deep field surveys, will help to provide clues about the role that dark matter plays in the structure of the universe. In particular, the way galaxies form and interact with each other can offer insights into the nature of dark matter and how it affects the expansion of the universe. Moreover, the James Webb Space Telescope's unprecedented capability to detect and analyze the atmospheres of exoplanets will allow researchers to refine their search for planets that might harbor life. By studying the chemical composition of distant exoplanet atmospheres, scientists can identify key biosignatures, molecules that are associated with biological activity. This data could guide the search for habitable planets, bringing us closer to answering the profound question. Is there life elsewhere in the universe? While the JWST focuses primarily on infrared observations, it complements and enhances the work of other observatories, such as the Hubble Space Telescope and the upcoming Nancy Grace Roman Space Telescope. The data from these telescopes will be integrated, offering a multi-wavelength view of the universe and allowing scientists to approach problems from different perspectives. For example, Hubble's ability to observe invisible and ultraviolet wavelengths combined with JWST's infrared observations, provides a more complete understanding of cosmic phenomena. In addition to its scientific contributions, the James Webb Space Telescope also symbolizes international collaboration. Scientists, engineers, and organizations from around the world have worked together on this ambitious mission. The telescope's development involved a global effort, with key contributions from NASA, the European Space Agency, ESA, and the Canadian Space Agency, CSA. This partnership underscores the importance of international cooperation in advancing our knowledge of the universe and demonstrates how space exploration can unite people across borders in the pursuit of discovery. As the JWST continues to make groundbreaking discoveries, it will inspire future generations to pursue careers in science, technology, engineering, and mathematics, STEM.
The telescope's mission showcases the power of human ingenuity and determination in overcoming complex challenges to push the boundaries of knowledge. Its success will undoubtedly inspire new space missions, both within our solar system and beyond, and pave the way for further exploration of the universe. The legacy of the James Webb Space Telescope will not only be measured by the discoveries it makes, but also by the way it fosters a sense of wonder and curiosity about the cosmos. As we look toward the future, the JWST stands as a beacon of exploration, a symbol of the boundless potential of science to expand our understanding of the universe and our place within it. The James Webb Space Telescope, JWST, has not only advanced our scientific understanding but has also become a symbol of human perseverance and international collaboration. By combining efforts from NASA, the European Space Agency, ESA, and the Canadian Space Agency, CSA, the mission highlights the power of working together across borders to achieve groundbreaking goals. The JWST's success has set a new standard for space exploration, showing how complex engineering challenges can be overcome to achieve extraordinary results. It is a testament to the brilliance of the scientists and engineers who made the mission possible. As we move forward, the JWST will continue to provide valuable data, pushing the boundaries of our knowledge and inspiring new generations of scientists and explorers. Its discoveries will shape not only our understanding of the cosmos but also the technologies that will drive future space missions. By enabling us to study the universe in unparalleled detail, the telescope is laying the groundwork for future missions that could explore even more distant regions, unravel more cosmic mysteries, and potentially lead to the discovery of extraterrestrial life. The JWST has opened a new era of exploration, one that will continue to captivate humanity's imagination and deepen our connection to the universe for years to come.